Assalamu alaikum, welcome to my easy chat learn channel. Today we will discuss a very hot topic that is how can we design products admin panel. So let's start and first continue. For this reasons, at first we will install Django Admin LTE 3. After installation, Django Admin LTE 3, follow my videos and just chill and enjoy. <coughs> For this reason, at first we will install Django Admin LTE. For this reason, you enter your browser and just copy this Django admin LTE 3. Just copy it and paste at your terminal or CMD. Before this, you should activate your virtual environment at your project. Here, paste, just paste. If I have installed, then here will be shown the package has been already installed. My record already satisfied. So, uh, if your record is not satisfied, then uh, Django admin LTE will be installed in this uh, virtual environment. After install this, go to code editor, go to your code editor, and just set two or three places. Uh, as, as at first enter your ecom project or at first enter your project after enter your project go to settings.py after going settings.py scroll below uh, here install the app just add us here just add us here admin LTE 3 and admin LTE theme just add it here and you will get this admin LTE admin LTE theme from the installation document of Django admin LTE 3 here shown install tab here or uh, add to install tab install tab a admin LTE 3 and admin LTE theme after that you should copy this python manage.py collect static and after copy this so just paste just paste add your terminal when you will paste this <coughs> then at your project all static files will be copied it to your static files As at first your static files is blank but after loading your static file by pip in a sorry for that Python manage.py collect static after copy this line after copy this line and paste to your terminal then all static file will be copied to your static files oh great after that if you run again your <coughs> project and enter your browser just go to your admin panel
just go to from here just go to your admin panel after running that if you go to your admin panel then you have shown a very interesting and attractive admin panel my project is running after running that just go to your admin panel oh great uh, you look a very attractive and interesting admin panel here uh, from here you can go to your home admin in or if you add your user then just click a very interesting admin panel in your word after that after complete these tasks you should add you should after complete after complete this task, you should design your product admin panel. Or if I say your product, here not added product, but if you edit your product, then you should design your product admin panel and image you should show your image in line in this admin panel. For this reason you should do some short tasks that is at first go to your code editor at first go to your code editor then go to your admin dot pi go to your product app and go to your admin dot pi here just enter admin dot site dot register and product product after that if you <coughs> again reload your admin panel then you will look your products f here product database here and after that you if you add any product here just write add and if you add category all data will be shown here but i need to at first i add one product samsung product but here shown only product but i want to show images here images here i want to show images here and want to show date created date updated date or status here or for for this reason you need to work some that are go to your admin dot pi admin dot pi and create a class class product admin product admin admin dot model admin and that here list display list display sorry for that list display list display and list filter are for our working smoothly i have already written in my cmd so for this reason i just copy this and hair paste
first copy. Okay. And I just paste here. At, at first, I create at product admin. Then in product admin, I show list display. List display has title, status, created, at, updated, and image tag. In my product model, well, there has no image tag attribute. If you look, there has no image tag attribute. But here, but here, I added a image tag attribute. And from where I get image tag attribute? But image tag attribute, I will get. from here by creating a function if i create a function on just image tag just image tag in this function i call a marcef marcef is importing from django.utils.cvst after that this image tag this image tag is just importing here list this list display here list display here list filters are how many products is needed to show in our admin panel here amount of product you want to show or oh, at your admin panel list per page here search filter or by which keywords as you want to search for search keywords now you need to add product admin admin site dot register product comma product admin after that if you reload your admin pay admin panel product admin you will show oh great here are shown your samsung mobiles admin images and when you created it, these products here shown created at and updated at oh great that's so much interesting and that is our today's lecture Now I want to deliver a summary of today's lecture. At first, we installed Django admin LT from this. Is after install relation Django admin LT, we added admin lte3 and admin lte3 to your to our installed app that is consistent in settings.py after that just copy this python manage.py and call it a static and paste to your cmd or terminal after that all static files is copied to our static files at first static files is empty after copying all static files here shown admin and mid lt3 csa spawns and by this way our admin panel will be very most interesting and enjoyable and attractive admin panel after that for showing product images in our admin panel in line main pages as for this reason just we add mark save just we add in models.py in models.py Django utils safe string mark self. 
after that we created dev image tag and return mark save image as here given image sizes height and